welcome back guys in the last episode we worked on the farms down there and really I I, I honestly thought it wasn't that long until I went through uh, my editor my editing and then found out that it was like close to 30 minutes so hopefully this episode won't be as long and but as you can see I am level 30 in the bar and I got all these books from my last AFK session haven't been getting very lucky on the mending books though, so hopefully that is just a one-off. But yeah, we're slowly but surely getting a good amount of um, items. Sharpness 3, Super Pink Edge 3, so that'd be good on this sword, wouldn't it? Um, anything else? We've got Acro Affinity up there and Depth Strider down here. I think that's pretty much it for all the good books at the moment. Uh, yeah, but because we are level 30, uh, oh, I've uh, kind of run off without getting any. Lapis Lazuli, uh, so we need some of this and put it onto that. Also, whilst I'm over here, I keep on, <laughs> I keep on pulling it away, but I found this uh, little hole which needs to be corrected right now. I think the only reason why I didn't do it was because um, I didn't have enough, I didn't have enough of uh, brown stained clay. But now we have enough to do it. Let's do a diamond shovel. So efficiency three. So we know it's not going to be that good. Um, but if anything, we can just put another enchant on it. Oh, well then, that is a uh, pretty damn disappointing. But some things for this episode is that I want to. Oh, that's not a chest I can open. Do we have an efficiency three book? So there's one. I so I think that's what I'm breaking three. There's another one. Breaking protection fortune. I don't want protection on it. Or oh. I think that's. Oh wait, yeah. So that's gonna give me. Probably put efficiency five on it, you know, just efficiency four and breaking through. So I can skip that one. So I don't need that. Um, I can probably skip that one as well. So just need two books, and I think my anvil is down in the farm area. Do you know what? Whilst I'm also up here, because otherwise I'm just gonna forget again. Let's go and get the red stain clay. Do I have any? I don't think I have any. Mm. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I'm actually colorblind, so it's pretty color. Uh, it's pretty weird seeing not seeing, being able to see colors properly, but you know what? It works out. So let's get in here. Oh wait, where's the block? There it is. Okay. Let's uh, go for a little row over here. Very nice. Um, and I haven't done much since the last little bit. I won't show you on this bit because I'm gonna just do I'm gonna do it all off camera and then eventually come back. But we're on episode number 22 now. What are we doing? Going for the anvil. It, it honestly does seem like a bit weird how fast I've done everything, but in all, in all honesty, I've been enjoying it. So yeah, efficiency three, sorry, e efficiency three, efficiency four, and breaking three. So pretty damn good. Um, so what are we doing now? Let's wait. It doesn't have a note. So let's go. Whilst we are over here, let's go put the. Yeah, I don't like how... I like how the top bit looks, but I don't like how the bottom bit looks. So I'll change that eventually. But I think the thing which I've been doing recently, and it's not very good, and this is if you're building in general, I mean, I think it's mainly because it's the Bible. If it's in creative, I'd spend a lot more time doing stuff, so I might start a creative server uh, series where I basically work on designs. Oops, a daisies. Uh, so let's take the torch, let's take the sticks, and... Oh, and the coal. And that was right it. Wait, do we leave the... We did leave the shovel. Very good. Um, yeah, so as I was saying, I've just been getting lazy. I've been going with, like, the first design. I might have something in my head, but as long as it looks... As long as i got it down and it looks semi-decent, I've just been going with that instead of, um, like, trying to, like, do an actual good design. And that's just been very... It's not good. Oops, a daisy. Actually, that looks fine. I just have a red one there. Um, so in this episode, what I'm going to do is... What are we going to do? I haven't really planned anything, so it's kind of late for me um, tonight whilst recording, so I haven't really got any plans. Um, do you know, I'm going to come back with a plan. Okay, so I just found some red stained clay where I put it, put it in here, so first thing we're going to do for this episode is, also I'd say what I'm going to do, I'm going to try and prettify all of the areas currently that we have with a bunch of decorations, so I think I'm going to keep the roof like that, um, it looks fine, 
Um, but some things we need to do first of all is get another piece of iron, and I think I know where some is. I'm going to also get the ore from this chest up here, which I've been reluctant to go and collect it because I'm lazy. <laughs> Uh, so let's get the iron from here and the diamonds and oh there's the mending book because I wonder where that was where that went sorry and also let's get all the coal because that's all the stuff that we got from does this still work yeah I'm just satisfied I got something to work like that <laughs> so let's go and let's go and get us started and we'll um so what have we got we've got the iron, the coal. So first thing I want to do, in case I forget, is get the shields in place. This is nice, this is done now. I can officially mark the starting area off completed. Um, I think I know what I wanted to put down. Oh, I still need to do this. It's just a bunch of little things I'm going to do in this episode. And I actually want to do a coca farm uh, in this episode as well. So I'll probably do that at the very end. So let's put the diamonds and the iron back. Uh, put the logs back as well. Probably need a couple more iron though. And let's get. So I'll get back onto the surface and I'll come back with you. I think the main reason why I wanted those shears, I don't want, I don't want vines though, is to get leaves mainly because the, I think the main thing that's missing from our area, like the underground area on all the paths, is a little, ow, is a little bit of shrubbery. So never, you can never go wrong with a little bit of um shrubbery so let's get this now oh that is so satisfying Whew. probably go with jungle leaves because it gives much more um i like the colors of it mainly so i will come back with all this done and get down back down there Oops. <laughs> so we're back down in the area i've got a few stacks of uh jungle and just 51 oak so I think what I want to do is go down here and basically come across and just like fill up the area. Um, yeah. So we did kind of something like this for one of the servers on Iskal's public server. Um, and it basically gives off a nice little, it's like a different texture and also the water on the sides, it's like it's running through, which might sound weird because it doesn't look as good but I think it looks fine. So yeah. There we go. Oh nice. Nice nice nice. But I'll come back and do some other areas. I'll do the one down there and the one down there as well. And I'll also widen this area because it doesn't look that good. Okay I can just instantly tell that this looks ten times better than it was before. It's a little bit tighter to swim through but if I just do stuff like I've done over here and in these corners just for around the rest of it, I probably won't use much of the oak leaves. It was definitely a mistake um, picking those up. But what I've just been doing is something like that. It's just very simple, just going in the opposite direction. And then I suppose I could potentially just bring it across the roof like so. So then that goes up a bit. It's very hard to build and be boating as well. <laughs> um, and I suppose I'll just do this. So this almost gives it like an abandoned feel, I suppose, like ruins. So let's go see how that looks, thank you. Oh, oh god, yes. Um, also got a comment on my lighting to not use torches anymore, because it, it is uh, getting a bit apparent I'm quite dependent on those. So as I slowly push another boat away, uh, we're going to go and get a different lighting source. I think I've got it in one of these chests. It might be in the one upstairs. I think it's in the one upstairs. Let's go. Let's go get that. And it is glowstone, by the way. Um, I probably will eventually change the. Um, uh, the what was I saying? Oh, hello. Um, sorry for the weird mouse. Then. Uh, oh, sorry. We got TNT as well. So if we wanted to do a, like a natural path, we could do that. And also, I've been messing around with the snapshot. Um, as well so eventually we're going to do my bedroom because um i've got an idea to do with that so yeah let's get down here and replace oh this is when the this is where the birch can come in okay so i know for a fact that they won't mobs won't spawn on leaves so if we completely black this out oh come on game thank you and just have 
Oh, that's that's a little bit. That's quite spooky. The problem is they're going to spawn up here, aren't they? So let's like hide something like that. They might not spawn on here. What's giving that light? Oh, I know. There's a yeah, there's a torch back there. So completely dark now, so it just gives it that bit more effect. So what I'm going to do is go down here and we'll go on this block here, see how this looks. Lighting and... Oh god. Whew. That is nice. It's just enough night light, sorry. Okay, so I'll come back and do the rest of them. Oops, the daisies. So I haven't done much, but... So I've just... I think I've done four, but the way... The light it gives off is so very nice. Like, just like the spotlights there, like... It almost like directs your path. I think oh, sorry, I did five in total. I think I did four more. But yeah, you just see that, that S curve. Oh, that is so very nice. And that's what I was going for. And this is slowly but surely becoming exactly what I want. So what I'm going to do now is probably because I think mobs can spawn. I'm going to enclose this, put a door in the front. Because this isn't supposed to be... I mean, it does look... As you know, it looks terrible, let's be honest. Um... So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, with cobble, oh look that's an iron door, perfect, um, I mean yeah because an iron door is using that isn't it. So let's block off this, um, like so, and let's just add the door there, where is my door, that is not my door, there is my door, uh, do I have any sticks on me, no but I can make some. And the reason why I want sticks, I want a lever. I can't. Because what I'll be doing, most likely, is hang on, let's place down this door and the lever on top. Perfect. I, it's insane that I have to check that that works. Of course it works. <laughs> uh, so, what, what's going to be happening is I'm going to be coming in here, flicking the switch. Oh. Oh no. How am I going to get out? Uh, so then, that gets me out. Then if I do this and then go in... I didn't want to do that. So let's get in and here. And then this should give me a... No. That maybe? Yeah, okay. So let's do, let's do this on this side. So it's nice and simple get out. So you walk out. Perfect. You get up to it. You walk onto this side. And you flick the switch, and you flick the switch, and you walk forward, and then that opens it. Perfect. Okay, that was a little bit too overcomplicated for what it was. Uh, okay, so whilst we are here, let's go and just do the entire area in this kind of style. So, could probably do a couple more lights down here, completely get rid of that and that. Because now, if anything does spawn on there, I'm protected, so I don't really mind. So then, basically bring this forward a bit. I think the holes... Yeah, so then you can see that that one down there is covered. But the ones in front of it aren't. So I can then technically... So let's put the lights in the floor again. And then I kind of... I think that's going to be... So if I have it one wide, oh wait, no, this could be like the platform for it. Oh, oh god, yes! And then, let's have that over top just a bit. So let's see how that looks. Do you say it looks good? Oh, that looks fine. And then you come up, and then it's like, uh, yeah, you don't even notice the lever, really. And then, and then that, and then that opens it, and then you're all locked in. And then no mobs can get in technically. Probably should do a button then saying that. Let's do a yes. I think it's just like no. Okay, so it needs smooth stone. Uh, but I'll come back and do that. Change it. So what have we done so far? We've got some leaves. We start doing this area. It looks very very nice. A lot more better than it was. I oh wait, did I show you um what I did up here? Like so it looks more like the other side. So I just opened up a bit more. I might do it again and then also open up this one so it's like up to there and also it has like a more. A branch, but in this one, I need to do something a bit different. I have to go get some more wood. So that one is completely abandoned. This one's still in use, and it was originally a mining area. So torches are fine. I'm gonna have to add some more beams, beams, beams across 
like I've done over here, just um, just very simple beams, and then I'll come back and do that. Actually, no, I gotta go back over to the swamp. Okay, this is ridiculous. I'm starting to get so many boats underneath here because I keep on getting to get them. So yeah, I'll probably get like a stack and a half of uh, oak and then come back. Okay, so there we go. I've got exactly a stack and a half of oh, a stack and a half of just normal oak. Um, I probably won't use the jungle for this because, like I said earlier, it's is basically for the um, cocoa bean farm. Because I don't think you can place cocoa beans on any other wood surface. I might be wrong. I probably am. I would not be surprised. Um, yeah, I have actually made this small little path. The fuck? Oh, no. Okay, okay. This is when I won't be able to do it. I think there's no four block jumps. Nope. Oh, okay. I got I got most way there. Yeah, so... Slowly but surely... Oh, that was, like, way too far. Slowly but surely, improving the area. I tell you what... Wait, is this sand? Yeah. I feel quite dumb now, because I should have used that fortune shovel, which broke in one of the previous episodes, and got tons of coal. That would have been such a smart solution. And just had like a normally normal efficiency 5 pick for everything else. Oh god, I feel so dumb now. Oh, oh well. Oh, we haven't actually used... That is fast. I was like, ready? Oh, that is... That is definitely satisfying. Wow. So, let's get down there and I'll be right back. Alright, so we're here and this is going to be... Uh, I don't really know what I decided to do, so let's just try something out. And let's say along this bar here. Oh, that is an apple, not wood blocks. So let's put those across because it might be the fact that I want to do it like one lower, which might be a lot smarter idea. And then let's go across this one. Oh, come on. This is really hard to do while swimming. There we go. Okay, so we got it. Yep, nice and... Oh, that... Oh, we can make a little labyrinth. Oh, that'd be so nice. Like a little... Uh... So it keeps on connecting, like, across. And then we can have, like, lower levels. So this one could be one as well. Or is this going to look a little bit too busy, I wonder? We'll have to have a look. Um, hopefully it doesn't. It's like the beam is supporting another beam, maybe. Think of the law. that's mainly... Like, they did the original beams, and they were like... Well, if we replace them, the whole system's going to crash. So if we just place the beam underneath the first beam... That might be a little bit too woody. Um, I don't really know. Let's just try this one across. I'm literally going to do this one in the boat, because I think it's going to be a little... Coming back, that actually does look quite nice. From what I saw, from that mini, mini glimpse. Um... As my dog wants attention downstairs, I should probably go give it to him. Um, yeah, I think that's going to look fine, maybe. Or maybe I'm just looking too far into it. And it's just, like, not... I think it's a little bit too busy. I think it's too much of the same texture. I wonder if I add some leaves to it. Some oak leaves, because it's um, an oak area. So if we maybe... Oh, wait, do I still have the shears on me? Nope, but I can make some... Actually, no, I might just keep that there for now. And then... Hopefully that looks fine. So it's just, like, again, drooping down. But in the last one, it's, like, a properly abandoned. Yeah, I definitely like how it connects it as well. So let's put that to the water. Oh, I... Oh, did you see that? That looked nice. Okay, so... I'm going to go out and get some more leaves. But just that little, like, glimpse in there. Lovely jubbly. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go... Okay, so what I'm going to do first of all is go across and do the beams. So, let's see how I did it. So, this one... So, the bottom one needs to be, like, up here, maybe. So... Oh, that's right. That's why there was cobble there. I think the cobble just adds more character, mainly. I think that's a fine requirement. No, not requirement, sorry. A fine addition. Okay, and then probably across this one here. Just go along like this. I probably don't even have enough um, oak, do I? 
Probably not. So yeah, just keep on going like cross hatch design like we did in the main area, and then I'll come back over and do a whole layer of um, leaves in the roof. So I haven't done it all. However, I think I've done most of it. Well, I've definitely I've done all the wood. It's just all of the leaves. I definitely like it a lot more than it was. I also added these bits down here. I think that's definitely the way to go. And then this is just going to be a basic area because this is just like the pathway to all of the. Um, yeah, that's nice. That little hole. It's just little things like that. Little details. You just need to work on. Um, and that's how you improve and build. It's just like, what can you add? I understand simplicity is sometimes key, but that's why I started off with this series. Oh, with like, and it, it's just not a smart idea in my opinion. Um, like, I'm going to eventually probably change the roof because although cobble worked at the time because it was like one of our first builds, it's not working now. Um, so that, I, I like I like this one a lot more though. It, oh, it looks so nice. Let's... Oh wait, it's not as nice as I remembered it. I thought it was like... I, I mean, I didn't overdo it. It's quite simple. So let's get in here and put on our shaders. And let's get a thumbnail for this video. Oh my goodness. This place looks so... Pr I love the shaders, by the way. Um, can I turn up my brightness anymore? No, what if I turn it down a bit, maybe? Oh, that'd be nice. Okay, so let's get a picture of both of them, because this is what the so this is what the um, thumbnail is going to be anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Like it's going to be either one of these two tunnels, because uh, the what's it called farm is not going to be that much. The coca farm isn't going to be that much. See, it looks nice when you go through here, but I don't think there's enough detail, especially down at the very bottom down there, like with the leaves, to have this as a redeemable um, profile. Not profile, thumbnail. So I think I, I've taken pictures of both of them, and I'm gonna put them into Photoshop. And I'm sure you guys already know what it is, but I definitely think it's gonna be that one over there. It's not because I'm biased; it's, it's, it's my video. <laughs> so next thing we're gonna do is work on a very, very, very simple um, farm. Oh wait, this hasn't all spread. Um, I don't know. That's also Try and do a bit of improvised. This weird. This weird that this hasn't all. Wait, has it all spread or no? By the looks of things, it has. Oh no, it hasn't. Not at all. Is it really that far from every other chunk? Or maybe it's because it doesn't have lights. So let's go through and add some light. Oh, it's a good thing we have silk touch. It's too bad we're on a horse. Um, I think it's called Spider. Sorry if I forgot your name. Yeah, your name's Spider. So let's also, I'll also go in there and put down a light as well. Okay, I'm, I'm taking off the texture pack, the, the resource pack, sorry. No, the shaders pack, going back to internal. And also, I don't know why that is on hard, on peaceful. I was like, why is there no mobs anywhere? Anyway, this is where the, the farm is going to go. So it's literally just up there. So if I want to get some cocoa... I most likely won't make a little hole for the horse to sit. Actually, no, I probably should, shouldn't I? Um, so where am I going? Down here. So let's go do that first. Let's put a little hole in for the spider, and I'll come back. Oh my, we're going to have some fun here. Okay, so going through all those chests earlier, trying to find a single piece of iron, reminded me we have TNT. So instead of doing a... Oh, that was... Really anticlimactic. <laughs> okay, so instead of, like I was saying, mining out an area and not making it look natural, ow, let's do a, let's do a, you know, a good old fashioned TNT cave to get to where we want to go. Um, so let's put this one two blocks in. Hopefully I have plenty of dirt, if not, I have my super shovel now and I'll just go get it. Yeah, so this is slowly but surely going the right way. Nice. Uh, so let's go in here. Uh, wait, I, I think I need to be too high, don't I? Probably. Um, and I think this is... It, it doesn't need to be far. That's the whole thing of this. Um, I literally just want a wall. 
So yeah, I think that's going to be as high as I go and as far as I go. So I'm going to come back with a little area just just find the cocoa beans. So originally I just wanted my I wanted a, like an automatic or semi automatic cocoa fi cocoa farm um, and just wanted it to be like I think what my original idea was it, like you would have a set of pistons that would push that way and then that would disrupt all the cocoa beans and then that would do the other way and then it would also and then it would basically revert back but then oh, I hate placing logs and I was like I don't ever need cocoa beans because what am I going to use it for like brown dye and then once I have a sheep farm which I'm going to do in one of these upcoming okay first the first first things first that's um there we go <laughs> uh yeah so as I was saying one of the first things that I was going to do is like have a automatic cocoa farm but then it's just it seems pretty useless because once you have a sheep farm Brown becomes useless. Like, what is he? What could be useful? Oh, actually, saying that, uh, the reason why I do want cocoa beans, and the reason why I'm doing it in this episode, is that for when I upgrade, I hate placing blocks on camera. <laughs> I'm, I'm fine doing it off camera because everything just needs to work a lot better. But yeah, the reason why I'm doing it on camera now is because, oh my, that looks terrible. <laughs> I hate the texture for jungle wood. It's terrible. But as I finish my sentence again, the reason why I want to do it now is because if you didn't, guys didn't know, Minecraft added, sorry, Mojang added parrots to Minecraft, which is amazing. So we're going to go and get those in a future episode, hopefully, as long as everything goes to plan. Uh, it seems to be quite dark in here, so I had to just try and fix stuff. I was going to put uh, a decoration block in there, but if we're not going to come up here that often... Oh, that is not what I wanted. There's really no points. So just a little bit of light down and then we'll be fine. And I think I was just going to call it for this area. Oh wait, actually no, saying that, I do need to replace all of this with dirt. I'm probably just going to AFK over here so I can let all the grass grow over. Like for example, you see it just coming up now. I think it's going to I think it's going to come up there. I'm not sure though because I don't know how. I think it needs light levels. But I don't know. If we had a silk touch shovel, that would make everything so much easier. Um, I think I'm a bit using a bit too much glowstone because it's not really fitting with the area as well. Um, hopefully this episode hasn't gone, hasn't been that long. I have to check for how long we've been going for. Um, but yeah, I have got a future plan, uh, future plans um, coming up for this channel as well. So that is going to be very exciting. Hopefully it all works out as well. And if you guys are still watching, remember to like this video because it always, I always watch all my videos. I know, let, let me say that again. I don't watch any of my videos, but I always watch, um, it always comes up on the like notifications when you get like a, a comment or a subscriber. And it's just, it makes my day every single time, every single time. It's amazing. So yeah, I'll probably just do this. I definitely don't have enough blocks of this whole area. Oh wait, is that? No, I think that's not that. Yeah, yeah, that makes a lot more sense. So I definitely don't have enough blocks of this entire area. So I have to go mining, mining for dirt. Excavation, maybe? I don't know what that's... I'll be the official Jargon for that. I do not know. But yeah, unfortunately, we're going to run out of dirt. So I'll have to do this all off camera. And... I'll see how far I'm... Oh, I found another piece of dirt. So I'm going to see how far I'm doing. If not, I'll get another little small little project. Maybe we'll do a little home for the the horse. But this all works out. It's, it's all got tons of room. So I don't really mind doing it. I might put like one down here for him. Um, I think we're going to name the rest of my horses. And probably, if we can, my tools as well. I've got one name for one of them. And then... Oh, hello. Um... That was a bit weird. So whilst we're up here, where did I put my iron? There's my iron. Let's get my name tags, which are somewhere there. Is my name tags? So yeah, let's um, first of all make an anvil for up here because we've got one down in the farm area, and honestly, I just cannot be that bothered to go and get them, which sounds terrible, but oh well. Um, 
Oh, why was I going to put iron up there? That's a bit weird. So first name is going to be Otto. Next name is going to be... Um, whose name should we do? I had a name, I can't think of it. It's going to be a girl's name. I think that's going to be... It's quite human names for animals. And this one, just because I can, is... Monty's plus one. <laughs> How many, how many levels do we have? So we have a lot more names. So let's go with a name for the sword and go Diana. The reason why I said that is because I saw like diamond. I was like, that's a perfect name for a diamond sword, Diana. Um, so name for pickaxe. Is it a forging pickaxe? Mm, okay, I got, like, I got a name. Oh, I've run out of levels. Oh, what a shame. Uh, so let's do one of these. I'm pretty sure I can change the name. Yeah, I can. So, a name for a fast working shovel, a diamond shovel. Um, oh, I don't know. So, this one's going to be called Hope, just because I used to know one so when I was younger. Uh, probably should do a boy's name now. Let's do someone who I used to know. Let's do George. And can I do another one? I can. Wait, can I? No. Okay. Uh, what about you? Oh, yeah, I can do another one. Okay, so. A diamond axe. I've got a name. It's going to sound weird, but. So her name is Sherry. Because she shears things. Oh, well, she can. Okay, so. Let's get the names on the hot bar. So Monty's plus one, Tracy and Otto. So you look like an, a Tracy. I was going to say you look like Otto. Oh, you're Pats. Oh, so have all my horses got names? And then this one down here is going to be Monty's plus one because he's just she. Yeah, Monty's plus one. It could be him or her. All we know is Monty's friend. Uh, so no questions asked. Uh, let's go get another saddle. Probably from one of these chests. I'm sorry if any of you... There we go, so we've got a saddle. Uh, so let's go get another horse and I'll name him there. And for where out thou is the one that shall name be Romeo. I mean also. I do not know. I know there's a horse somewhere around here. Maybe he's just gone wandering off. Maybe he just doesn't like the name Otto. What if I renamed him? Would he come back to me? Oh, no, did he fall down? Oh no. Okay, so I know this is here, and I know this has been here for quite a while. <gasps> no, there's there's Otto. Hello, Otto. So first of all, let's get the horse. Actually, no, you're, you're, let's name you first. Let's force you. Let's force you on. Let's force a name upon you. So you're very very weak. Um, so let's hope you're fast and agile. This is probably going to take a couple of attempts, isn't it? No. Oh, come on, Otto. Come on, Otto. Not being friendly to me now, Otto. Come on. No, you're... On. I knew that wasn't going to be the one. You were nodding your head or you are sighing your head. Come on. You can do it. Are you going to go left? Maybe this one? No? Maybe? Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't see the hearts. How very... Oh, you are fast there, Otto, aren't you? So, now we got Diana, George, and then... Sherry. Wait, can I put that in my sheet? That was weird, I couldn't shift click it. Um, so now what we've got to do is... Ugh, get past, and... This is to hold down to the path. Like a so... Probably should be doing all this off camera. Ow. 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 They're probably the... Okay, I'm going to die. Probably. And that is a spider in my base. 
I have to find out where these things are coming from because it is getting a little bit annoying at this point. Um, so I don't know how this was before, so we'll just have to go. I think, yeah, that looks fine. Why not? And let's put the torch back up. So that is going to be the end for this video. If you guys, oh, my mouse. If you guys did enjoy this video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next adventure. Peace.